<laughs> Stop! <laughs> Money! What is it? Nothing. <laughs> Where are you going? You're not allowed to leave the house. Shh, go away. <laughs> Money! <laughs> okay! <laughs> Guys, dinner's ready. <laughs> Give me some. <laughs> no! <laughs> Mr. Anderson! <laughs> oh, give me some! No! Mr. Anderson! Okay, fine! <laughs> hey, can you give me the notes? Shh, no! Mr. Anderson! <laughs> Hey, are you hungry? Do you want something to eat? Oh, I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> I'm full. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Kevin, where are your Oreos at? We ran out. Just take the chocolate. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Lucas, check this out. Kevin, I hear your mum coming. Put your phone away. Why? Because she's going to come in and see. Boys, aren't you tired? No, we're on our phones. Can you get us more snacks? Okay. Your mum lets you stay up? My mum lets me go to bed at any time. Your mum is the same, right? Give me your phone, laptop, and all your other devices. But mummy, it's only 10 o'clock. It's bedtime. Go to sleep. If I have to come back one more time, you are grounded. <laughs> Alright, Lucas, let's find this address so I can finally buy my phone. You got it, Kevin. I got the address, and it's this house right here. <laughs> This is it, Lucas. Are you sure this is the right address? Absolutely, Kevin. This is the place. <laughs> Lucas, Kevin? What are you guys doing here? Ah, Mr. Anderson, we uh, thought this was the place to buy a phone. A phone? I'm not selling a phone. Lucas, are you sure this is the right address? Kevin, I got the address from. It's next door. Well, I'm not selling a phone, but you two can both come in and I can give you a lesson on double-checking addresses. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Anderson. We'll be on our way now. <laughs> Uno, change the colour to red. <laughs> oh, no, he has a red. We need to change the colour, otherwise he wins. Don't worry, trust me. I have a wild card. I can change the colour. Okay. Change the colour to green. <laughs> oh no! I tricked you! I win! I win! <laughs> Hello? Hey Lucas, I'm coming over to give you my Christmas present. Oh, okay. <gasps> I didn't have a present for Kevin. <laughs> Lucas? Oh, thanks, Kevin. Merry Christmas to you too. <laughs> Mummy, I'm hungry. Go to the fridge and find something. Right now I'm busy setting up for your sibling's birthday party. The guests are coming over in 30 minutes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Sweetie, did you find something to eat? <laughs> well, I found this really good cake and I cut myself a piece. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, Mummy? Wanna try it, Pete? No! <laughs> hey, Mummy, I'm hungry. Okay, sweetie, we'll go out and get some food after I make this phone call. I'll be outside our room. Okay. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> See you later. Goodbye. Okay, sweetie, are you ready to eat? <gasps>
there, would you like to record your own personalised message? <laughs> okay. Your message will play from inside your bear every time it's hugged. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, whenever you're ready. <clears throat> Okay, all done. Your bear's all good to go. Thank you. <laughs> Sweetie, check out it's in two minutes. I want you to take all the free stuff from our hotel room and put it in your bag. But mum, are you sure it's free? Yes, quickly get the shampoo and all the other stuff. Hurry! Okay. <laughs> so, sweetie, did you take all the stuff from our hotel room? I sure did, Mum. <laughs> sweetie, where did you get that chocolate? <laughs> oh, you didn't see the fridge? They had all these snacks in there. You okay, Mummy? I got you a Coke. got you? Yes, it's great. I can return it if you want something else. It's fine. I love socks. <laughs> Thanks, Uncle Frank. I hate Uncle Frank. He gave me the worst present ever. I wanted a toy, not stupid socks. <laughs> Hello, would you like any flight snacks today? <laughs> oh, okay. I'll take a Dorito and a Coke. Sure thing. Is there anything else? That's all, thanks. Great. That comes to a total of $23.90. This costs money? Yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> Mommy. <gasps> what is it? Your son has purchased a packet of Doritos and a Coke. The total comes to $23.90. How would you like to pay? Cash or card? <laughs> Want a Dorito? I need to go toilet. Why don't you go at half time? If you go now, you might miss something. I need to go now. No one has scored a goal yet. I'll be two minutes. Nothing's gonna happen. Okay. watching the news. stop sign okay there's a stop sign sweetie all right mom sweetie there's a stop sign <laughs> Here. <laughs> hey, Mum! He's eating the fries! 
No, it wasn't. I was just checking to see if all the food was in there. Guys, can we wait until we get home? Then we can eat. Oh, it's Shrek, Donkey, Fiona, Spongebob, Patrick, Squidward, Rick and Morty. Jeez, why is your password so long? Because it says it needs to have at least eight characters. Duh. <laughs> All right, good night. Good night. Hey Siri, set an alarm for 6 a.m. 6 a.m.? But it's 3 a.m. right now. It's fine. My body clock is used to it. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Mummy. Okay, I'll put you on speaker. Hey, honey, what's up? Honey, I just put on the news and there's a crazy person driving on the wrong side of the highway. Please be careful. Okay, we'll be careful. <laughs> Hold on. Are you sure it's just one person? Everybody's driving the wrong way. Ah! Sweetie, I just got off the phone with your teacher and she told me that you were getting bullied in class. Well, there are these kids that come up to me and they give me a choice between a dollar or two dollars. And every time I pick a dollar, they call me stupid and laugh at me. But don't you know that two dollars is worth more? I know, but I also know if I pick two dollars, then they'll stop. And now I've made... essay okay did you do your english essay yes i did okay well hand it in well there's two options one i fail my english essay or two you go home pick up the english essay that i left on the kitchen table ah! <laughs> <gasps> mom can i please have this ninja turtle toy no, Lucas, put it back. Come on, we need to leave now. Well, I'm not leaving unless I get this toy. Well, I guess I'm leaving without you. Well, good. I don't need you. I can be on my own. I'm leaving. Bye. <gasps> Mummy will come back. <gasps> ah! Mum? <gasps> Hey mum, I don't get it. How come you can't do all the chores yourself? You know what? That's a great idea. How about I do all the chores? Really? Yeah. You've been busy running around with friends, watching movies. You should be playing video games now. I agree. I'll clean your room, do all your homework. You must be very exhausted. Sweet! Thanks, Mum! <laughs> huh? What are you doing? <laughs> I'm playing video games. I was being sarcastic! What's a sarcastic? You need to leave the house. <laughs> Why? There are ghosts in here. You and your family need to leave. Ghosts? <laughs> Mummy! What? The cleaner went up to 
to me and told me that there are ghosts in the house. Oh my god. Pack your bag, sweetie. We need to leave. <gasps> Is what the cleaner said true? There's ghosts in the house? We don't have a cleaner. <laughs> 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 and there's one more present from Grandma. Happy birthday, love. <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. <laughs> to Grandson. Happy birthday. You make me so happy. Love, Grandma. <laughs> Thank you so much for the card, Grandma. It's so nice. I think you missed something. There's money. Huh? Oh, <laughs> I did not see that. <laughs> Thanks so much, Grandma. It's a little too much. I can't accept this. Oh, he's so humble. I know. Our family have taught him so well, haven't we? Yes! <laughs> Kevin, are you dressed up as our English teacher, Mr. Anderson? Yep, happy Halloween! But what if Mr. Anderson finds out? He's not going to find out, we're not at school. Now come on, let's go trick-or-treating. <laughs> trick-or-treat! <gasps> Kevin, are you dressed up as me? Maybe. Can I have some treats? Yeah. I got other treats. I want chapter three done by tomorrow. Kevin, the house next door gave me Kit Kats. What did you get? I got a study. Trick or treat. Sorry, kid. I don't do Halloween. Oh, that's okay, sir. Have a great day. <laughs> Kevin, look what I got. You got a whole chocolate bar? Where did you get that from? The house next door. They have heaps of chocolate. <laughs> Sweet! <laughs> Trick or treat! So sorry, love. I just ran out of sweets. Oh, really? How about I show you a trick? That's nice. <laughs> hey, Mummy, I made you a cookie. Oh, that's great, sweetie. Thank you. Try it. Okay. What do you think? Do you like it? I love it, sweetie. You are a great cook. Yes! <laughs> I'm going to go make more. <laughs> oh, it's okay. You see, if Mummy was to have another cookie, then Mummy won't stop eating all the cookies. You don't want Mummy to have a tummy ache, right? Okay, I'm going to make more tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Here's your drink, sir. And your food will be out shortly. Thank you. Well, might as well try the drink. I should wait for my food. One more sip. Sorry about the wait. Enjoy. <gasps> oh, come on! <laughs> Teleportation. <laughs> Well, I guess you're not joining us for McDonald's for dinner. <laughs> Can I have some nuggets? It's you!
Share it, so give me a piece. Cool, fine. I want the red part. No, the red part's mine. Too bad. Give me the red part, or I'm telling mum. Fine, but give me that piece back. No. <gasps> That's it. You're not getting the red part anymore. <laughs> Mummy! What's going on? Nothing. I gave him a piece of my gummy snake. Nah, he won't share. Give me that. There. <gasps> <laughs> now no more fighting. <laughs> Hi, can I please get two ham and cheese pizzas? Sure thing, that will be coming right up. <laughs> two ham and cheese pizzas? Yes! <laughs> Thank you. Did you guys order two ham and cheese pizzas? <laughs> uh, yeah, we, we already have our two ham and cheese pizzas. Oh, really? That's weird. <laughs> Never mind. What? Kevin! That was two extra pizzas for free! Oh yeah. <laughs> hey mum. Hi Mrs. Linda. Hey boys, how was school? It was good. Can Kevin sleep over? Huh? Uh, Kevin, did your parents say it was okay? Uh, <laughs> yeah? Well okay, you can sleep over. As long as your parents say it's okay. Yes! <laughs> can we also get McDonald's? No, no McDonald's. I already made some food at home. But Kevin's hungry. He wants McDonald's. Who cares? Oh, do you want McDonald's, Kevin? Uh, I didn't say... Yes, yes. Uh, yeah? Okay, I guess we can have something small. What would you like, Kevin? Uh, uh not much. Like, he wants a large Big Mac meal. Fun pass! <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, let's play musical freeze. Lucas, you're out. Nah, I was pushed. Timmy pushed me. <gasps> no, I didn't. I would never do that. What? Lucas, I know that Timmy is a good boy. He would never push you, okay? We saw you move, so you're out. <laughs> <laughs> Draw two. <laughs> Draw two. Draw two. <laughs> Draw two. <laughs> Draw two. <laughs> oh. Draw two. <laughs> Draw two. <laughs> I'm changing the song. I am the one, it's me. Kill my ex. It's pretty good, I guess. Stop singing! You cannot sing! <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, I dropped my phone. Can you see it? Mm, no, I can't find it. That's okay, I'll call it. <gasps> Kevin, no, it's not on silent. I can hear it. Kevin, end the call! But it's somewhere there. I know, but people are trying to. Shh! Hey, buddy, people are trying to watch a movie. Turn your phone off. Have you found it? <sighs> 
Yes, I did! Great, but have your phone on silent next time. People are watching the movie. Ha! Your turn! <laughs> hmm. Uh... Blue six. Changed it to red. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Nothing. It's your turn. Okay, class. Heads down, thumbs up. <laughs> 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 White shoes. White shoes. <laughs> Kevin, quick! Let's swap our shoes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and heads up, stand up. <laughs> Epic Lucas. No, it was Kevin. <laughs> what? <laughs> but nah, you're lying. I saw someone with white shoes picked me. You're right, but after Kevin picked you, we swapped our shoes because we knew you were going to look. <gasps> you were looking? Who <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> Oh, Look, it's the Muffin Man. What the? Do you know the Muffin Man? Class, everyone in their planking positions. Ugh. And start planking. <laughs> hey, you're cheating. Yeah, who cares? The teacher's looking that way. He won't look at us. <laughs> well done this side. Let's check the other side. Kevin! <laughs> Sorry, sir. Okay, class, everyone can stop except Kevin. We are going to watch him plank for two minutes without stopping. What? Stop planking! Oh. <laughs> Keep going, Kevin! <laughs> Kevin! Yeah? Can you call my school and pretend you're my mum? Why do you want me to do that? I don't want to go to school today. Just call them and say my son is sick. Okay. Yes! <laughs> Hello? Hi, is this Mr. Anderson? Yes, it is. I'm Lucas's mum. <laughs> Oh, hello, Lucas's mum. How can I help? My son can't come into school today. He's very sick. Oh, that's not good. Well, he does have detention today after school. Can he come to that? He won't be able to make that either because he's got something on. Really? Lucas knew he had detention. What has he got on? He's, uh... He's being baptised. Baptised? <laughs> you idiot! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I knew it! <laughs> hey mom, tomorrow during the day I'm gonna be hanging out with my friend. Okay, have fun. <laughs> One sec. Hey mom, where are you? I'm out. Out? You didn't tell me you were going out. I did, I told you yesterday I'm hanging out with my friend. You didn't tell me. Oh yeah. What time are you coming home? I don't know, in an hour. Okay. Are you sure you told me about this? Yes! Hmm. Well, give me more notice next time. <laughs> okay, I think we should go to bed now. <sighs> okay, I'm just going to set the alarm for 7 a.m. 7 a.m.? Yeah, so we can start the day early. But it's 4 a.m. right now. So? I get up at 7 a.m. all the time. We're going to have less than three hours sleep. Oh, we'll be fine. My body clock is always used to it. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Mum, I know it's early. <laughs> Can you pick me up? Here you go, Jackson. What's this for? It's money for the book fair. Emma was telling me it was this week. Oh, so you're giving us more money? What do you mean, more money? Mom gave us both money for the book fair yesterday. She did? 
Timmy, are you ready to go now? I don't want to go home. No, we're not going home, silly. Where are we going then? To the ice cream parlour. Yes! And then after, we can go swimming. Thank you, but could you push me on the swing once more? Go on then. I just love days out with you, Mom. So, why do you think I brought you here today? I don't know, because you haven't seen me in a year? Nope. Because I'm your son and you miss me? No, it's to ask whose idea it was for me to pay for your trip to France. Oh, that was Mum's idea. See you, Timmy, then, love. Yeah, see ya. Oh, and Timmy. Yeah? Can you tell your dad to book you into the dentist? Yeah, fine. Oh, also. What? Tell him to buy you a new pair of school shoes, because I bought the last pair. Can't you just tell him yourself? Hello, matey. Hi, Dad. Could you tell your mother she owes me 20 quid for letting you stay last week? But I'm your son. Nothing's free in this world, son. She's right there. Tell her yourself. Tell your father to brush his teeth. I can smell his breath from here. Oh, get her life, Claire. You two are pathetic. Everyone in non-uniform remembers to hand in your pound. Here's my man. Thank you, Tabitha. Er, uh, miss? Yes? Say if hypothetically. You forgot your pound, haven't you? Yeah. Well, you're going to have to get changed. My mum gave me a fiver, miss. Or oh, Dean, could you lend me a pound? Sure. No! He's literally just said yes. It is school policy. What if Timmy wears half of my clothes and I wear half of his? No! Timmy, get changed or pay off. I think you are the only person in uniform today. Cheers, Dean. Thanks for that. Look at Timmy's house. My house, really? Yeah, you always have good sweets. Hello? Trick or treat! Oh, don't you three look good! Thanks, Claire, I'm dressed as Karen. Very scary. Take a sweet. Can we have two each? Oh, go on then, and here's a pound each. Thanks, Claire! Timmy, knock at your house! No, my dad hates Halloween! Just do it and get us some sweets! Fine! Hi, Dad! Go away! Ah! Hey, Mum, have a great day! Timmy, it's hard! It's gonna be so late! Um, Why won't you let me in? I've got math! Timmy, what are you doing? It's 9 a.m. I'm late for Mrs. Pine's letter. Yeah, but Tim. Plus, if I'm late again, I'll have to go to the back of the lunch queue for a week. Right. And you know how much I love my pizza bagels. Yeah. Why are you not in uniform? It's half term. You're joking? No. I can't believe this. Well, I'm going at the pot with Kieran to eat some dirt if you want to join. Well, I suppose I've got my baby bells from my pet long show. Why not? Well, then I've got something to tell you. Right, okay. I have got you a few things from the shop to cheer you up. Thanks, Mum. What's up? Your dad and I have decided to go our separate ways. Will I still be able to go on my school trip? Trip. Yes, your dad can pay for that one. Oh, really? Absolutely. Plus, you get two birthdays and two Christmases. Well, I guess that doesn't sound so bad. Done? Yeah. Me and your mother are getting a divorce. Okay. Well, I'll see you in a few years. Will I not see you every week? Uh, probably not. I'm starving. Shame. Boys, it's dinner. What we got, Mum? You get what you're given. Just tell me. Sausage casserole. What? I ain't having that. You what? I'm gonna go. Stay, Dean. Okay. Pass me the ball. Why? What? what? If you don't eat it all, no pudding! Okay! Oi, Mum, what's for dinner? Oh, it's an earlove, chicken and rice! Uh, it's your favourite! I'm ordering a takeaway, you stupid woman! But... Shut up! Okay. You look nice. Oh, hello? Mum, I'm really ill! What's wrong? I've got a sore throat, a headache, and I'm pretty sure I've got worms! Oh dear, what do you need me to get you? I don't know, Mum! Right, I'll grab you some cowpaw lucasade and digestive. Yeah! And on my way home, I'll grab you a McDonald's. Thanks so much, Mum! I can't have my baby feeling poorly! Oh, Dad, I'm so poorly! The only thing you've got is I'd like to now get up and get on with it! Okay, and have a shower, you stink! Kids! What's up? Yes, Dad? You guys really like these vitamin gummies now, don't you? Yeah, I do! They're yummy. Which one of you switched them? It wasn't me. I don't know. I guess I'll just have to check the camera. Timmy, I'm back! Did you get me the new FIFA? No, I was getting you stuff for school. Oh god, what did you get? Your lunchbox! What the hell is that? What do you mean? Dinosaurs! You love T-Rexes! Yes, mum, when I was like five! Don't be so ungrateful! I wouldn't be seen dead carrying that! Stop being stupid, it's perfect! Do you want me to get bullied? You're being dramatic! That's it, I'm never going back to school! You are, and you're taking your lunchbox with you! Nice lunchbox, Timmy. Shut up, Dean! Right, are we doing an all-nighter? On a school night? Yeah, why not? That's a valid point. I don't get tired anyway. Me neither, I could play for like three days straight. I did five days and still went to a family barbecue once. This is going to be easy! Morning class, I hope everyone's ready for the day. Sorry I'm late, miss. Timmy, sit down. Yeah, okay. Unbelievable. It's ready for year seven! Me! I got pens, paper, rulers, sharpeners! That's a lot! That's not all! Oh! Pipex, bare underwear! Bare underwear! Food tech ingredients, two PE kits, and my very own whiteboard! Thought you were prepared! The only thing I'm not prepared for is where room K5 is for first period! You're gonna be half an hour late! Yeah, yeah, okay! You're in year 11, get up! Maybe later! It will fail all your GCSEs! I can't cope with that boy! Um, what? There's a thunderstorm! We need 
needs to turn off all the switches in the house! I don't like it! We need to be prepared! Did someone say thunderstorm? Yeah! One elephant, two elephants! What are you doing? Coming between his thunder and lightning to see how far it is! Oh, I hope it's close! Here, put these shoes on! Why? They are the conductor of electricity in case you get struck! What do you mean in case we get struck? Listen to it roar! Oh, I better check on Grandad! Oh, it's a bit windy! Hello? Is your mum in? No, she's at work. Well, do you want to buy this vase? How much? 200 pounds. Right. It was handcrafted by the gods of the Himalayan mountains in 500 BC. That does sound quite antique. There's only one of them in the world. Is that so? What are you doing? Oh, I'm just using the Gwang Gap and it says it's one pound from next. How did you do that? The Gwang Gap even searches any product and finds out where it's from. Well, it's still vintage. No, Karen, it's from next. So take your vase and get off my property. Ah! Goodbye. Hey, why aren't you ready? For what? We're going out for dinner in 10 minutes. Come on! Okay, fine! Hair done! Smelling nice! Okay, Mum, ready to go! She looked like a goat, Julie. What is she doing? Red or green? Green. Oh, come on! Okay, that should do it! Finally! Why aren't you in the car ready to go? Of course you'd say that! You in bed? Just finishing off my homework! It's 11.30pm! I know, but I need to get it done at in tomorrow! Well, you better hurry up then! I've been doing it for four hours! Okay, class, homework! Oh, miss, I forgot mine! I forgot mine too! I've got mine! Put your hand up if you've done the homework! Just Timmy? Yep! Okay, I'll give you all an extra week to finish. What? Oh, and Timmy, you may as well do yours again because I'm going to change the question slightly. Ridiculous. Hurry up late, miss! Just in time, I need your email, Timmy. Email? Why? It's an extra precaution. Will my phone number be okay? Timmy, email! Right, well... Speak up! So, it's Tabitha for his love forever underscore simple hotmail.com. What was that? Tabitha for his love forever with a four because I thought it was quirky. Right. Then underscore simp at the end because I'm a simp for her. Ew! I made it when I was seven! Right, Dean? Mrs. Toxfit at Outlook.com. Dean? Couldn't get Hotmail, it was already taken. If you hit me once more, you win! Oh, okay! Oh, no way you got me! <laughs> you're so bad! What? I thought you were better than that! No, I let him win! You didn't, you're just the worst! <laughs> no, I'm not! I'll be embarrassed, son! Come here, then I'll show you! But now am I? Son! Timothy, get off your brother now! What? You're older, you should know better! But- No, come here, my little munchkin! This is just ridiculous. What's for dinner tonight? I was thinking of doing a sausage casserole. Sausage casserole? Yeah! Sounds great! Hey, Toby! What? Mum's making a sausage casserole tonight. Okay. But we want to take away, don't we? Oh, yeah? If you go ask Mum, we'll say yes to you. What about you? No, it has to be you, because you're the youngest. Okay. Mum, can we have a takeaway tonight? Yes, anything for you, darling. Yes! Okay, because Timmy told me to ask. Timothy! Oh, no. Back soon, just nip in the shop. Okay, Mum! How long has my mum been gone? Two hours! Steve, we need Chris. They're never going back! Couldn't agree more. Pick up the phone! Should we do beef on Sunday? I do love a bit of beef. Oh, God, no, 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 I can't live alone! Why has Timmy tried to call me 50 times? Thank God, I knew it! What? Which hospital are they at? Timmy! Yes, I'm next of kin. Timmy, I'm not a doctor, it's Mum, and I'm on my way back. <laughs> oh, right. Fair enough, bye. What time is it? 8.04. Oh god, I was meant to be back at 8. What's that? He's here, Timothy! Oh dear god. I've been searching for you for ages. It's been four minutes. That is four minutes too long. Well, it's not that long. Get home now, I've had the police looking for you. That's a little extreme. I'll show you extreme. Okay, okay, let's go home, god. I was meant to be home at 8. Well, it's 11 p.m. Why hasn't my dad called me yet? Hey Dad! Hey Mom! Sit down, Timmy. Yeah, what she said. Okay. We had a phone call today. Apparently you're not our son. Steve! Sorry. He was on your phone in class today, now give it here! Oh, really? You can have it back at the end of the week. The end of the week? Yes, I'm hiding the phone and me and your dad are popping out, so behave. Fine! Fo 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 fo! Aha, yes! She will never know! Know what? <laughs> Here! Go long! <laughs> Who knew I'm done for? Who's just on that? Me! What a great shot! What? I've been waiting to change these windows for years! Dean, is she not angry? No. Come inside you two, we've got pizza for tea! Race you upstairs! Wait, Dean, no! Is that shoes on my carpet? Yeah, what's wrong with that? Is that the time? Gotta go! Get here! <laughs> what a day! Timmy, over here! Hey, Mum, thanks for picking me up! Well, I followed you all the way back on my little track rack. Weird, but okay! I've got to make sure my little boy's safe! Hi, Dad, I can't see you in the car park. 
What? You forgot, haven't you? No, son, just stop walking. I have. Where are you? In the middle of nowhere. Son, you, you're breaking up. Dad? Who's that, Steve? Oh, no one important. Another round? Hey. Yes, thanks, Mum. Go get yourself something nice. Ooh, cake, no price, excuse me. Yes? How much is this? Let me check. Thank you. That's eleven ninety nine. Eleven ninety nine. Yeah, what's wrong with that? Nothing. What a bargain. Are you gonna buy it then? I just remembered that I already have it. It came out yesterday. Yes, I think I'll come back for it later. Actually, you're not gonna buy it, are you? Not a chance. It's pure daylight robbery. <laughs> you're too slow. Oh, hello, Claire. I've come to pick up Timmy. Oh no. What are we gonna do? Should we hide? That never works. Would you like to come in for a coffee? I guess I've got a bit of time. I don't want to go home. We're done for. Bye, dear. What was that? Where are they? Let's go check. Janice was there, you know. Mum, what are you doing? I'm just having a quick coffee. Five more minutes. That's at least another hour. Maybe even two. Enjoy, ladies. I'd better be sitting next to you. If you want, I'll probably cry. Okay, this year's eating plan will be boy, girl, boy, girl. What? Is there a problem, Timmy? No, of course there's a problem. I guess this is it. So we have Timmy. Great. Next to Timmy, we have Tabitha. What? Hey, Timmy. Yes. Oh, hi there, Tabitha. Hi. Bye, Dean. Dean, you're next to Petunia. <laughs> Thanks, Mum, see ya! Oh, and Timmy? Yeah? Please don't ring me at 2am to come and pick you up this time. I won't, Mum, I promise I'm going to sleep over. Right then, night, Timmy, have you got enough blankets? I suppose one more couldn't hurt. <sighs> Guess this will have to do then. <sighs> Off to sleep, I go. <sighs> I can do this. <sighs> I can't do this! Hello? Mum, can you come get me, please? What? Just tell Dean's dad I've got gangrene in my toe or something. Timothy! Sorry. Right, are we ready to go? Yeah! Then let's go to Alton Towers! Can't we? What on earth is that? A random? Give them here now! Mum! No food, snacks, drink, slime and certainly no paint in my car! God, sorry! Right then, let's be off for your comfy in the back! Yeah, it's very snug! Great, let me just find my... <gasps> What's that smell? Ah, roast dinner from last week! Dad, that's disgusting! What's this? I can do this! I can't do this! Oh! Hello, miss, I think I broke my arm! Right, okay. Can you help me? Can you wiggle it? No! Can you feel this? Oh, yes! What about this? Get your hands away from me! Well, it looks fine to me. Put a wet paper towel on it. I think I need to go home. Why don't you go back to class, and if it still hurts at the end of the day, you can go home. Then it's home time anyway. Correct. Hi, Mom! Hello, guys, you must be Tabitha. Yeah, hi! How lovely! Yeah, we're just gonna go in my room now. Okay, but Timmy... Yes? Leave your door open, will ya? Yes, Mom! Hey, Dad! Oh, back already? I do finish school at three every day. Who's that? Hi, I'm Tabitha. You're the one Timmy fancies and says he wants to kiss all the time! <laughs> Dad! She doesn't show up about ya! Bit weird, really. Bye, Dad! Oh, Timmy! Yeah? She's a keeper. I give up with you, Dad. Why aren't you ready? Why are you dressed like that? It's the Queen's Platinum Jubilee! So? So get downstairs! This is a once-in-a-lifetime celebration! Right, who's ready for today? Steve, put on the National Anthem! Seriously? We're having afternoon tea and there's a street party at two! I am not even the half of you two dressed like that! I beg your pardon! You look like a unicorn with sick on you! That's a bit rude. And Dad looks like he stole his hat from a child! I did. Well, there is no chance I am dressing up like that! This is ridiculous. Right, come on, I don't want you to be late. Okay, thanks, Mum. Come on, five minutes till lesson. Timmy? Yeah? What did I say about those shoes? They're inappropriate. They're literally black and you're wearing high heels. And Dean, what's that coat? You can't wear big coats to school. Oh, right, but it's okay for you two. Attitude, you're both late to class now, so you can come and see me at the end of the day. We're late because you won't shut up about what we're wearing. I beg your pardon. And by the way, I stole blue tap from your whiteboard last week. Burn. Detention for both of you! Worth it! Mum! Mum! Yes, Mum? I have a surprise for you! Oh, really? What is it? Sit down! Okay. At school, we all drew our faces. Right. And Mrs. Top put them on a tea towel for our mum's look. Oh, wow. Look at Dean. Yeah. Oh, top of us is good luck. And what do you think of mine? Where is it? Well. Is that a bird? No, it's my face. Oh, it's brilliant. You hate it, don't you? I'm burning it! Yeah! I got you them! No, you didn't! Oh, yes, I did! Did you get them from Shoe Zone? Does it look like I got them from Shoe Zone? Yes! But, Timmy, they're very expensive, so look after them. I will, Mum! Come on, Timmy, get the ball! I've got it! Yes, that's it! I can run so fast in my new... Shoes! Hey, Mum! Timothy, David, Andrew, Philip, Gray! So my shoe has a mouth now. Pretty cool, right? No! Yeah, I'm gonna go. Timmy, dinner's ready! Yes, finally! Hurry up before it goes cold! What have we got? Oh, just a fillet steak with blue cheese sauce, rosemary fries and green beans. Whoa, whoa, well, you really have to do yourself here? Oh, it was nothing, really. Mum, this looks incredible! It came in my Hello Fresh order this morning. Convenient! Oh, wow, what of art! Hmm, appetite.
advertising. I couldn't be bothered to go to the supermarket, so that'll do. Well, I guess you still could be something. It's frozen, the chicken nugget's still frozen. You know the slide? Yes! Okay, let's, Kieran! What? Can we go down the slide? No! Just move, Kieran! It's my slide now! If you don't move, I'll... You'll what? Oh! Damn it, I don't know, he got me good. Hey, Kieran! What? what? Who did that to my son? Ah! Run! Wanna go on the swings to me? I do love a good swing! Come on then, let's get you in! Whoa, 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 who's the baby swing for? Me? No, son! You're ready. Ready for what? The big swing. No, Steve, he's too young for the big swing. He is not, are you, son? I suppose I am 14 now. Well, fine, but be careful. Wow, this is incredible. See, I told you it was fine. Wee -wee -wee -wee. Come on, Timmy, get up. Yeah, that ain't right. Let's take him to a &E. Is that the time, boys? It's time to go. What? If we leave now, we won't get caught in traffic. Can someone help me off if we're going? But, Mom! No buts! Fine! Just make sure you've got your shoes and clean the sand off your feet. Done, let's go. I'll be fine, just leave me here. Right, the car's been freshly hoovered to no sand. Don't worry, I managed to get every last bit of sand off my... Maybe there's a couple of stubborn bits. What did I say? Ah! Where's Dean? Oh, no. Ah, He's picking us up today. Uh... Boys, I'm here. My mum! I stopped off and got you both a packet of crisps and a drink from the shop. Oh, thanks, Clara! It's okay, I was here 20 minutes early, so I thought, why not? Cheers, Mum! Also, if Dean wants to come out tonight, he can, and I'll drop him off later. Who's getting us today? My dad. Right. Yeah. He's forgot to get us, hasn't he? Yeah. <sighs> was that supposed to be somewhere? Nah. Mum! What do you want? It's PE today, I'm hoping to! Don't ask if you can take your new trainers, Timmy! Please, Mum, I promise I'll look after them! Okay, okay, fine, Timmy, but you better look after them! I will! I can't believe you wore your new trainers in PE today! I know I can't, oh no! What? I left them in the changing room! You're screwed. Hi, Mum! Where are your trainers? Well, about that! What's Dean doing? What do you mean? Anyone want to buy any? Oh, that'll be the Aston delivery, Timmy! Get it, please! Fine! Hello, unfortunately we've run out of beef, so I'll put some Skittles in instead, is that alright? Skittles instead of beef? Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure that'll be fine. Where's my beef joint? Oh, they ran out, so they put some Skittles in instead. How am I going to make beef stew with these? I don't know, just taste the rainbow. Come here, little caterpillar, yes! You're safe with me, little guy. Hey, Mum, I'm just going to go play Xbox. Timmy! What? I just need you to... What have you got? Nothing. I can see it, Timmy. What is it? It's my new pet, Kevin the Caterpillar. Timmy, you are not keeping a Caterpillar as a pet. Please, Mum, I'll take it on a walk every day and I'll even pick up its poo. No, Timmy, just give it here. No! Kevin! Hi, Grandma, I'm going to work now. Okay, darling. And remember, no sweets for Timmy because he's grounded. Great. I'll put my foot down on that little bugger. Good, see you later. Bye, Mum. Oh, no, I forgot my purse. Sweets for everyone! Yes! Absolutely delicious. Why did your mum still meet you across at the lollipop lady? She's protective. Good boy. This is embarrassing. What? Karen's a lollipop lady. Hurry up, boys. What happened to Trudy, the old lollipop lady? She got run over. Fair enough. Are you crossing or not? Yeah. Hurry up then. Karen, there's a car. Stop. I am the lollipop lady. You just run into the room. You have to stop. I'm the one with the lollipop. Not anymore. Come back. And they are. Year 10. They're so mature! Let's go over! That is such a suicide! I have to get my nails done this week! Hey girls! Hi! So what brings you here? Aren't you two in like year seven? <laughs> Funny, good one! Do something! I have a yo-yo, watch this trick! A yo-yo? Yeah! Oh. That looked like it hurt! No it didn't! Yeah, are you okay? Blah! Hope I haven't gone over the parking! We have been here for hours! No we haven't, don't be- oh god! What? It. it has been that like four hours. Where is that idiot? Excuse me. Yes. What is this? A ticket. Obviously. Why is it on my car? You paid for two hours. Right. And you've been here for four. This is not on. What's your name? I don't have to give you that. It's Claire. Timmy, shut up. Sorry. Second name? Gray. Spelled with an A, not an E. Oh. No, no. Timmy. Yeah. Come here, please. I've just got to feed the cat. We don't have a cat, Timmy. Damn it. Do you know anything about a phone call I had today? Oh, uh, no. You had a detention, Timmy. Ah, oh, yeah, that. You just wait till your dad gets home. Did you stick the kettle on, love? Your son got a detention today. Hi, Dad. Right, what did he do? He superglued Dean's face to the table. Ah. Tell him 
Steve? Yes, that is totally brilliant! I did the same when I was a kid! Steve! <clears throat> yeah, that is totally inconsiderate. Right then, let's... Oh, no! What? Where did I park? Up there? No, it was up there, weren't it? I don't know! Yes, it's over here! Here we go! No, it's not here. It must be this way. Mum, are you joking? Just look for it, Timmy! Okay, chill! Have you found it? Yeah, it's here, Mum! <sighs> Hello? Ah! Stranger danger! Oh my god, we've got a supply teacher today! Should have put cling film on his face! No, let's change our name to confuse him! Okay! Right, what's your name, young boy? Dwayne! Dwayne what? The Rock Johnson! Really? Yes, and this is Simon Cowell! Hi! How strange! And what's your name, please? Err. Uh, Her name's Susan! Susan Boyle! <laughs> Enough detention for you, Dwayne! <laughs> I mean, call me Dwayne! His work has been exceptional this year! Yeah, Mum, look at my maths work! Well, Timmy, I'm so proud! He is one of my star year seven pupils! Timmy! Yeah? I've had a letter and apparently it's parents' evening this Friday. Yeah, Mum, it ain't even worth going. Dean's mum ain't going either, so I just won't bother. Oh, alright then. They're not coming, are they? It's ready for breakfast, Club. Can't wait. This morning for breakfast we have muesli and raisins thanks to Jamie Oliver. I hate that man. Just hold still, Tabitha! It really hurts, Mum! Don't be silly, it doesn't hurt! Ah! Good morning. Kieran, what happened to your uniform? Oh, I forgot to put it in the wash, but I doubt people will notice. Yeah, you look great. Thank you, I feel it. Please just drop me off at school before work, Mum. Dean, we live right next to school. Well, that's not the point, is it? Where's my mum? Come on, Dean! I better head back then. Just come mine. Would your mum let me? Yeah, it'll be fine. Oh, Timmy, am I dropping you home? Um... No, he's coming back to work. Oh! It's okay, Mrs. D, don't worry. That is so... Out of order, I know. Okay with me. What? Even sleep over if you want. Dean, my mum's Killed. You're so lucky. Why? What's your mum You think you can just turn up with your mate and expect him to be allowed in? No, I just... So I take it I can't stay for tea? That shit that make you shit and I'm like... From the Mackey's mom. That's your problem, boys. Steen. What? I don't think I can eat it all. So? I'm gonna get told off. Everything okay back there? Timmy can't finish his dinner. Dean. You what? I'm really sorry, Mrs. Davison. I'm just really full. Don't worry. Pass it here. What? I'll still get you a look, sorry. There's always room for pudding. Wait, what? I'm so confused. You don't care. So she's not angry? No. Why? What would your mum do? What are you? An idiot sandwich. Correct. Now go and finish your dinner. Yeah, sure. Dean, have you signed my shirt? Yeah, I've already done it. Oh, I haven't got him to sign it. Sign my shirt. I don't even know you. Yeah, it's all right. Just sign here. <laughs> Tell me, are you okay? I'm going to miss school. You can still come back and see us one day. <laughs> Kieran, it's not long school uniform. Yeah, what are you going to do about it? Kieran? It's the last day of school, so try and expel me. And the last book. Dean, what are you doing? Burning my box. Why? You can't be asked to carry them home. Can I get your love? Can I just get a bag of chips, please? Mum, can I get sausage as well? No! Salt and vinegar? Yes, please. Okay, there we go. Is that it? That is more than enough. Did you want the sausage? No, we're just going to make a chip butty at home. That's the worst thing I've ever heard. Timmy, a bag of chips is more than enough. We're at boss. I'll have a large fish, chips, mushy pizza, steak pie, two bad sausages, a donut kebab and a spam fritter. Is that everything? For me, yeah. What about me? Just get him a can of chips. Everyone, lunch is over. Mum, don't call me Mum, call me Mrs. Taylor. Kieran's being mean to me. No one is mean to my little baby. Kieran, your shirt again. It's uncomfortable. Right, detention. Worth it. Late again, Timmy. Yeah, sorry, miss, I overslept. It's 2 p.m., there's one hour left of school. Well, you know what they say. What? Gotta get that beauty sleep. I'm selling Prime free bottles for only £250. I'll take them. Do you prefer cash or card? No! What? I've just been really loud. Oh my god, that's your mum, what do we do? What do you mean? It's late and I've woke her up. Boys, it's 4am. I'm so sorry, Diane. Why didn't you tell me you were having an all-nighter? What? I could have got you a Mackie. Don't worry, mum. I'll treat you to a Mackie's breakfast instead. Thanks, mum. Love you both. What was that? Yeah, she don't mind. You are so lucky. Why, what was your mum get? Anything else you want to say? Sorry. Not good enough. Ah! For the day, year 11. No. Timmy. Don't even talk to me. Timmy, I'm off to work. School's not on, but please do your homework. Hello? Hi, Grandma. Are you ready to play some Scrabble? Brilliant. And I got you some Biscoff. Hmm. I could work with that. Dean, what are you doing? It strikes. What? No one told me. That sign's been there all week. 
Yeah, I didn't notice that. Hey, you saw it. Bye, Dad. Hello, darling. Here's your Mother's Day present. Charlotte Tilbury. Dad sorted it for me. Oh, that's kind of him. Do you like it? It's the best Mother's Day present ever. Well, you wouldn't believe what we got Tina for Mother's Day. You got Tina a present? Oh, Dad's at the door. He'll tell you what we got. You got her a five-star holiday to the Bahamas! Two weeks all-inclusive as well. Well, I thought you'd prefer the makeup. Of course you did. God, that's over. Well, thanks for getting my new school shoes, Dad. I don't know why I had to buy them, but, you know, I'll just put them in my... Whoa, 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 what are you doing? Taking them back to Mum's? You're not. You're keeping them at mine. But I'm only with you at the weekends. And? So how will I be able to wear them to school? Ask your mother. But I pay for them, so they're staying with me. Shoes? Timmy? Just ask my dad. Timmy, get the door. Oh, fine. Yes! Woohoo! Right, let's get you home, Steve. I'm just getting started. You're too drunk. I'm not drunk. Really? I'm just resting my eyes. I can smell that cabin from here. Be nice, Mom. No, she's a horrible bat and no one likes her. <clears throat> Timmy, come here. What now, Uncle Brian? I've got a dead fish in my bag, I want to see. No. What's the plan after this, Mom? We'll eat our ice cream, then we'll go to the farm, and then we're off to Centre Park. Best half term ever. And then Sunday, Alton Towers. Dean, you need to go outside, it's a lovely day. I'm good, Frank. No, now. Happy now. Night, night then, love. Grandma, just one thing. Yes, darling. I don't know if you know, but... It's only 5 p.m. Have fun to play, Steam D. Want to sell my tennis ball? No. Who's ready to play dodgeball? I will. I don't think he dodged it. Morning, darling. Happy Easter, Mom. Look what came for you. Is that all mine? Of course it is. Can I have it all today? Well, that's probably not the best idea. Good point, Poppy Fab. But you need to get ready because we're going Cadbury's world. What? And then your dad's picking you up, so I'm sure he's got you even more treats. Here you are, son. Dad, what's this? An egg for Easter. They're supposed to be chocolate. Whatever, just have a tender and shut up. Charming. Come on, son. I'm here. So, we need to sort bridesmaid dresses. Yeah. Oh, and we need to get Timmy a suit. Wait, are you getting married? Yes, didn't your dad tell ya? I did it last week outside Spoons. Right, I was drunk. And the wedding is next month. We've only been together two months. Well, when you know, you know. But I'm not coming. Oh, come on, Timmy. Fine. Thank you. But I'm not wearing a suit and you are definitely not touching my hair! I look like a penguin. I'm gonna bang you clean out! Oh yeah, do you know who my brother is? Who? Darren from year 11. Who's that? Yeah, he just sits in the library all day reading of mice and men. You're the reason God made a middle finger. Well, you're the reason your mum made a roast dinner on Sunday. What? I don't know. Miss, Timmy just tried to fight me. Timmy? You are such a snitch, Kieran. No, I'm not. I literally just watched you. Come on then, Dean, fight me. Hold me back, hold me back! There's no one there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, true. Fun boys! We'll do more! When does the train get here? He says he'll be here at... Oh no. All trains are cancelled due to scheduled strikes. Well that's brilliant, Dean. I just broke my leg. I'll call 999. Hello? Is this a doctor? Nah, they're on strike. Who is this then? The cleaner. That was useless, shall we just go school? Yeah, I'm sure they'll have a wet paper towel for my leg. Yeah, let's go. That is absolutely ridiculous. Coming over here! Oh, hi, Mum! Did you have a good day? Yeah, it was okay. What's this? Oh, dear. A full sandwich. I see how it looks. But you were hungry enough to eat your crisps and chocolate. I did have a bite. You call that a bite? Well, Dad doesn't eat them. What? He doesn't eat them. Your father loves my sandwiches. Well, I'm not sure about that. He eats them every day without fail. Ah. I'll move out, it's easier. Right, are we all ready to go? Yeah! Ah, Timmy, permission slip, please. Her what? Your permission slip to let you come on the trip. Here's my mess. Thank you, Dean. Well, that looked real. If you haven't got it, you'll have to stay with Miss Thomas. We're doing word searches. Yeah, this can't happen. Hello? Mum, I need a permission slip. I know, check your phone. How did you do that? I did it on Cam Scanner. It digitalises documents onto your phone with optimal scan quality. Yes, I can go now. Thanks, Mum. You missed the bus. Brilliant. Timmy, bedtime, matey. Mum always lets me stay up till nine. That's just the way I do things here. Oh, Mum is so much cooler than you. Hang on, what? Yeah, Mum's cooler. Did I say bedtime? I meant snack time. Can I stay up till nine, then? Even better. What? You don't have to go to bed at all. Can we watch an 18 plus movie? Yes. You are the best dad. Morning. What the hell happened? We did an all-nighter. Where's your father? Over there. See you next week. 
for going to get him, Claire. Oh, it's okay, Mrs. Tuck. Ready to go? Yeah. I think it was as soon as he saw that needle. It was at least three inches. Oh, he's always been funny with needles and blood. We get the point, Mum. Let's get you a Lucas Aid and a chocolate bar. Okay. And when we're home, we'll watch a nice film together. Thanks, Mum. Anything for my baby. Bye, Mrs. Tuck. Dad, I think I'm going to faint again. Oh, shut up, son. Yeah. I just fainted. You give me the egg. Who next? Oh, this house. The lady that lives here is hot. Isn't she about 80? Yeah. She's left the sweets out. Take one. I guess that's easy. Let's take them all. Oh, no. Why not? No one's here. That is kind of true. Well, go on then. Okay. We're going to have so many. Oh, Timmy. <laughs> oh, no. You little bugger. Oh. Now get off my land. I love you from Gordon, Mildred. You pervert. Yeah, okay, fine. It's always the porky ones. Thanks for that, Mildred. See you later, Mom. Oh, Timmy. Yeah? Remember, I'm at work, so no calling me. Okay, whatever. Palm for non school uniform. What? Did you seriously forget? Yes, clearly. Here's my palm, mate. Dean, why are you wearing shorts and crocs in November? Why to express myself? Timmy, you're not taking part? I forgot! Can't you ring your parents? Yes, my dad! Hello? Dad, I really need you to bring some clothes in for... Dad, hello? He's hung up.